Good morning, my dear. This is Ruby Teresa. You read the problem twice or thrice. Hmm? You should cultivate that habit. You have to read the problem. And also while you are doing in the notebook, please say the steps loudly. Otherwise silently also you can say, but you say the steps and do the problem. Then it will be thorough. You will be thorough with the identities. If a plus 1 by a equal to 6, then find the value of a cube plus 1 by a cube. A cube plus 1 by A cube. So this is in which form? Very good. Those who know it, you can write directly. Actually, within a minute you will be able to say the answer. First let me do that for the competitive exam purpose. How you have to do it. So A cube plus 1 by A cube equal to A plus 1 by A the whole cube minus 3 into A plus 1 by A. So A plus 1 by A is nothing but 6. So 6 cube minus 3 into 6. 6 cube is nothing but 216 minus 3 6 are 18. So you have to subtract. Understand? So 16 16 if I am getting 200 minus 2. That is 198. Understand? Do you follow? So in this way, those who know this, you can do it. Miss, I don't know this to write directly means what actually asking a cube plus 1 by a cube. This is nothing but what a plus b the whole cube. A, a cube plus b cube equal to a plus b the whole cube. Minus 3ab into a plus b. Those who know this you can write. Otherwise, from the identity you can derive a plus b the whole cube equal to a cube plus b cube plus 3ab into a plus b. So you want to find out this. So a cube plus b cube equal to a plus b the whole cube. Plus 3ab into a plus b. That is minus 3ab into a plus b. So if you know this directly, you can write it like this. Otherwise, you write this because all the students, most of the students, you know this identity. Isn't it? So from this you can derive. But in the place of a and b, what do you have? Very good. What do you have? a 1 by a. Otherwise, you can change and write also. If you want to write like this, you can write it. If you feel that it will be confusing, mean just you can change the variable. 3xy into x plus y. So in the place of x, what do you have? a, a cube plus in the place of y, 1 by a, a. That is 1 by a cube. x cube plus y cube. a cube plus 1 by a cube. x plus, sorry. A plus 1 by A. A plus 1 by A. The whole cube. Minus 3 into A into 1 by A into A plus 1 by A. Understand? Do you follow? So in the place of X you are substituting A. In the place of Y you are substituting 1 by A. That's all. So A plus 1 by A the whole cube. Minus A A get cancelled. So, minus 3 into a plus 1 by a. Then as usual procedure only. Understand? So, a plus 1 by a is nothing but 6. 6 cube minus 3 into a plus 1 by a is 6. So, 6 cube is what? 216. 216. 3, 6 are 18. Otherwise, usual subtraction. You do it. Understand? What is it? 1. Here, 11. Why? Uh, because from 6 you won't be able to do it. Then while you are taking 1, it will become 0. Otherwise, you go with the procedure. Here while you are taking, this will become 16. This will become 0. So, 16 minus 8 is 8. 0 minus 1, you can't do. So, 1. Here, 10. 10 minus 1 is 9. So, 198. 198. Do you follow or not? This how I did. Do you know? 16, 16. Just I am removing 16, 16 here. 
So here while you are removing 16, you will get 200. Here while you are removing 16, you will get 2. So 200 minus 2, it is easy for me to subtract. Like that I am subtracting. Do you follow? Since you feel that it is based on identity, you are leaving the problem. No. The basic identity just you remember always. From that you can derive it and you can do the problem. Don't omit it. Understand? Try to attend the problem. Understand? Do you follow?